Alrighty, boys, what is up? What is up? Welcome to another video. Uh, today we'll be using Daniel Jacobs. Daniel Jacobs is another fighter that was added to Undisputed Boxing. I've actually already done this matchup, uh, not while using Daniel, but while using uh, Amir Khan. And once again, man, this dude just reminds me of Kevin Holland. They, they really look alike. They do. I mean, it, it, on, if you look at them closely, of course, there's clear differences. But almost at a glance, at a glance, it's he. he that definitely reminds you of uh, of Kevin Holland. But um, we're gonna use them, and uh, we're gonna see what this feels like. Um, the last time that I again did this matchup, I was using Amir Khan, and I talked about how Amir Khan didn't really feel uh, ridiculously fast to me, but. I'm, I'm about to find out if he's if he's quick because now I'm fighting him and if I'm not able to deal with his speed you guys are gonna You guys are gonna realize that pretty damn quickly. So here we go We're not wasting any time my opponent wanted to get into the fight as quickly as I did. So here we are Let's see what's up. He's already working my body with the jabs Which is good I like how the announcer is already complaining that there's barely any action. Like, bro, we literally just started. The fight literally just started. Like, can you give us a bit of time? You want us to start ripping a thousand shots already? Like, come on, man. Oh, yeah. Right away. No, 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 no. I'm not going to have issues with this man's speed. Right away, I'm not. Look at this. I'm hitting him pretty clean. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Nah, we're not going to have any issues with this man's speed. Nice. Nice. He's getting he's getting hit clean. My hope is that I can I can stop this fight. Uh I definitely don't want another decision. That would honest I'll be I'll be real with you guys, man. If I go to a decision and I am fighting Amir Khan and I'm hitting this dude, if I keep hitting th this man like I'm hitting him right now and this fight ends up in a decision, that's really going to grind my gear, bro. That might that might that might be it for me, man. Honestly, there's no reason this fight should go to a decision because I'm finding shots I'm hitting this man clean I'm getting some nice counters and I'm facing Amir Khan who's supposed to have a glass chin there's no reason why this should not be a stoppage a stoppage win at least I should I should rock this guy a few times He's hitting me. There we go. I'm trying to work his body as well. Because he's he's trying to work mine, but I'm trying to make sure I'm also teeing off in his body. Um, I don't I definitely don't want to be the only one with low stamina. Because I know that's what he's trying to do. He's trying to get my stamina low. And if mine goes low, I want him to get low with me as well so here we go it's very interesting bro like this kind of tells you like everything you need to know about your game it's like he doesn't have a fear of getting knocked unconscious within the first two rounds it's like with this game it's it's almost a guarantee that regardless of how reckless your opponent is being you're not gonna get him out of there in the first round and it shouldn't be the case it should not be the case. Like, when you think about fights that go long in your boxing game, it should look a certain way. It should look a certain way. It shouldn't be fights where we're both, like, tagging each other in the head over and over and over again. It should be fights where both, both players are being extremely technical. Both players are being very 
uh, very careful. They're being quite defensive. They're picking their shots very well. They're barely landing clean shots. Like, in my opinion, in my honest opinion, a rock should have already happened. A rock should have already happened. If, if this was... If this was, say, UFC 4, with, like, the way he's fighting and the shots I've hit him with, I would have already rocked him. I, I would have already I would have already dropped him in, like, the first round based on the shots that I hit him with. He would have already been dropped. And, like, by the third round, he would have been... I would have been... I would have got him out of there. And I think this game, even though it's moving in the right direction, they're... they're I can tell that they're still quite afraid of ticking the power up enough. They're, they're still afraid of that. It reminds me of what we dealt with in, in UFC 2, man. Where, like, we were begging these people, bro. Freaking A. There's just... There's 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 a, a general fear when people are creating these combat sports games where everybody is afraid of... Which is why what EA MMA did is still revol revolutionary. EA MMA went the other route. They they did not give two fucks, bro. They were like, hey, if you mess up, if you do something reckless, you could get knocked out in the first second of the fight. And MM EA MMA was like that. It resulted in some absolute beautiful fights, bro. Where you came out insane, reckless, and you got put out clean. Like it's supposed to be. Hey man, I remember UFC one, EA UFC one. You couldn't even knock anybody out with the with the regular cross in the game. <laughs> and then in UFC two, it was like it, 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 shots still barely had any power. Man, we were like asking them freaking. Turn the power up. And they go, okay, we'll turn it up. And then they just, they, they tick it up. The slightest uptick you could imagine. And I'm like, what the frick? Like, damn. And it's like, I've, I've had people, I've had people go, oh, you complain about power, but you never throw power shots. It's like, it's like, sometimes I, I, I forget that like, all right, here we go. I'm running every round. It's like, bro, I don't, I shouldn't have to throw power shots to be able to get, res, to be able to get devastating results. Like, it's like, yeah, do y'all, do y'all, do y'all actually watch the sport that you claim to be fans of? Is what I don't understand. Like, do you watch the sport that that you claim to be fans of? Do you think it's haymakers and ex ex insanely wound up shots that result in the most knockouts and and stoppages in boxing? Is that what you guys see when you watch boxing? Like this is a, this this right here is straight up rock 'em sock 'em robots. That's what this is. And and like right now I'm just gonna I'm gonna try to walk this dude down because like this is this is straight up rock 'em sock 'em robots. We're literally not. Look at this. It's this is the one thing that like makes the game boring to me. That's just. Well, it's about to be round number five. Hopefully, uh, something happens. Hopefully, something happens soon. 
You know, it's like they added bruises and cuts to the game as well. You rarely see them. Like, we are, we've been bl blasting each other, bro. Like, where are the cuts? Where are the bruises? Where is the... It's, it's just, like, just the damage is just not enough. The damage is not enough. Please, stop being so goddamn scared of what's gonna happen if you overdo, overdo it, bro. Like, it's been... It's been... Like, a, a vast majority of the complaints in this game, in my opinion, it's like, will disappear if the power was, like, what it's supposed to be. Even the people that are throwing, like, the lead body uppercuts and whatever like if you're if you're a good boxer and you start and you time and you time some clean counters on them and you're able to get them out of there in the first two rounds watch what happens like watch what happens when players realize oh my god i can be finished in the first round you're gonna see a change in the way the game is played people are gonna come out and actually start feeling out feeling each other out being careful what they're throwing but right now, it's like a guarantee that, like, look at this. It's like, I'm I'm not worried about shit. And I know he's not worried about, he's not worried about nothing either. There we go. I'm throwing power. Uh-huh. Huh? Power shot. <laughs> Maybe I'll start winging hooks at him. Power shot. Power shot. Power shot. <clears throat> The, the issue of, like, people throwing thousands of strikes. It's like, that also would, would, would go away if, if, if fights were ending. You know? It's like, a big reason why boxers and fighters in general don't, like, throw a bazillion shots is because of the serious risk of getting caught. It's like, yes, they worry about their stamina as well, but there's also a, a serious risk of getting countered as you're throwing all these shots. I'm just going to wing host at this guy, see what happens. I'm just going to wing host at him and see what happens. Are you kidding me? <laughs> you want me to fight like a bum? That's what you guys want? You want me to stand in the middle and just throw hook, hook, hook? Are you kidding me right now, Undisputed? Oh my gosh, man. <laughs> it's the fact that he's like pressuring me. It's like I can easily I can stand toe to toe with this guy. I just don't like that style of fighting. It's just it's, uh, it's something, man. Something. Yeah. I think I am pretty much winning every single round. We're about to find out. I can't imagine there's a round that he's really won. But look at this. Oh, he won number f he won number four. Round number four. But I mean Ooh. 
We are in round number seven now. Round number seven now. And I'm trying to tee off on his body to see if maybe I can get a body rock, but nothing. Damn, my PC's screaming. What the hell? <laughs> my PC does not like uh does not does not like the amount of resources it's required to to run this game. It's screaming at me. Oh my gosh, man. Rock 'em, rock 'em, sock 'em, robots. These two were made for each other. Rock 'em, sock 'em, robots. Come on, please. Please. Well, this round is over. Round is over. I think I won the round. It's like I'm I'm definitely outboxing the guy, but like this fight, bro, when I was using Amir Khan, I was perfectly okay with going with decision because I know he's not he's not really known for like being a very powerful guy, but I am not okay with a decision in this fight, bro. I am not okay with a decision. I should have already stopped this dude. This fight should have already been stopped. Don't do this to me, Undisputed. Don't do this to me. You're about to turn me off completely. If I go to a goddamn decision, I am trying to get a stoppage. Trying to land clean counters. There we go. Yeah, see all these flashes? I mean, we're blasting them, man. We're hitting them clean. There we go. There we go. There we go. And now I'm going to pressure him a little bit. Yo, I thought you wanted to do toe-to-toe. -to -toe. Like, what is, what's going on? Like... I don't, I don't, I'm not sure what you want, sir. Because when I want to fight at, at range, you don't want to. Now I'm trying to go toe to toe. Now you're backing up. What's up, bro? Ay, ay, ay. All right. I'll just fight my fight. Man, this is round number nine. Ah, damn, bro. We got so many rounds still left. <laughs> I'm so fucking bored. <laughs> Come on. Damn. 30 minutes to one fight. Come on, man. Okay. Looks like they've shaken it off. Come on, come on. There we go. There we go. 
I think that was a ghost punt that dropped him right now. I think that was a ghost punch that dropped him. We're not going to be able to see because there's no replay, but I think a ghost punch dropped him. I don't think I was anywhere near him. But this is good. This is good. This is good. This is a, this is a step in the right direction, please. If we can do it again, if we can do it again, maybe we can get him out of here. There we go. There we go. There we go. There. Come on. Hey, they slowed down. They slowed down the movement after you after after a rock. They did. <laughs> did you guys did you guys account for uh, loose footwork while you were doing that? Because I don't think you guys did. I don't think you guys accounted for loose footwork while you guys were doing that. But um, the good news though is that we we sat him down in that in that last round. I think also it's just the fact that there's no there's no swelling on the face. There's no cut. There's <laughs> his face is red though. Yeah, I, you know that's something. That's something. Brave young knight. Come on, come on, come on. It's pretty clear that like the only way I can really rock him is with like is with me winging, winging hooks like a bomb, going hook, hook, hook. That's that's pretty much the only way I can rock this guy. Yeah, uh-huh. That's it. That's the yeah, sit him down again. Oh, he fell right in between my legs. Please just stay down, bro. Just stay down. Stay down. Stay down. Just don't get up. Whew. All right. Yeah, that's it. <sighs> All right. <laughs> Next up is going to be Vasily Lomachenko. All right. I know that's that's really what you guys have been waiting for. We're going to really try to test him out in every way. His movements, his strikes. His power, footwork, head movement, lunges. We'll try to test all that next time when we use them. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like on it. And uh, I'll see you guys later. Peace out. Have a good one. <clears throat>